Hey y'all, it's Taylor from Tattoo Teacher Plans. Welcome back to my channel. Today we are starting off 2020 with this really cute kit from Shop Jessica Hearts. You know I'm addicted to her monthly kits and I've already bought her February so it may just be a year of Shop Jessica Hearts monthly kits and I'm just totally not mad at that. I love her kits so much. So this is called Fresh Start and it is neutral and beautiful. So here are the full box covers across the top, date dots, payday flags. We've got these two cover up days that are not in the month. We've got the holidays and we've got a bunch of labels. I love the color scheme of this kit. Sidebar stickers. You can use these little labels to create your own sidebar, but I like just the decorative sidebar. And then we've got some more labels and icons here. And then we've got some full boxes here, some canceled stickers flags, bill dues, and some vacation strips. So I don't have a ton going on in this month. And <laughs> I feel like I say that every time. The month will definitely fill up. Here is how December is looking. Today is the 29th and it's looking just so, so cute. So let's see. I used a November kit from her and October. September I used a different shop, but since October I have been using her kits and I just, I'm saying we're going to have a year of Shop Jessica Hearts kits. I can just feel it. So let's go ahead and get started on this. I'm going to lay down the foundation of the spread and I'm going to, going to set up my monthly lists over here. So I do have my goals written for this month. I need to look at them before I fill out my list. So those are going to be probably blank for now. But next month I will probably, I just don't have everything together like I probably should. But next month, I will have my goal sheet to show you like my whole mind map, and I will reference that when I create my tending list for the month. But I do have a couple things to add on there. Anyway, I'm rambling. We're going to get the foundation set up, and then I'll come back and we'll do the plans together.
All right, here's the foundation done. So I have all of my day dots down and all of the basics. And then I have my list started and um, I'm gonna have to go back and think about my prayer list. But I love the reformat of this kit. I did ask her before I ordered this if she was reformatting because the December was for the old Erin Condren and it you have to like cut off the edges and the sidebar didn't fit quite right, but this fits perfectly. I love it. All right, so we are ready to go for the day by day plans. So let's go to the first, which is New Year's Day. And I don't have anything um, going on that day. So we're going to go on to the second. So I have two things this day. I have a brunch and I have a haircut. I'm just going to use some labels for both of those things. So for a haircut, um, hold on, I'm thinking of where I have stickers. Um, let's see. Uh, and what was the other thing? Brunch. Okay. So I've definitely got some food. And we're going to a kind of a breakfast place. It's just so, so delicious. Called uh, Butter Love. And it's all biscuit based. None of this is speaking to me. Let me go to Coffee Monsters Co. I know I have some brunch stickers in here. Here we go. Okay, I think I'm gonna use this one. And then haircut. I could just use an icon from the kit because I don't have any good haircut stickers. I have some ones more with loved ones that I do like. Let's see what I have left on that sheet. I've got these guys. Um, this is kind of cute. I'm in desperate need of a haircut so, so badly. Ooh, these are cute too. Why are these in here? Coffee. Coffee should go with like something else. I don't know why I put that in there. Um, let's put this somewhere else. With like food or something. Let's put it with the reading. Um, that would have actually been a really good one, but I already got this one out, so we will use that. Okay, so let's do just one label on here. So let's do one of these little natural looking ones for my haircut. So we have been trying to set up brunch, my group of friends, for months. We kind of um, gave up on our game night because we are just those people um but just some life changes and with people and we just haven't been able to keep up with everything so i'm really excited for our brunch and i've been to this place before and it is so good i mean how could it not be but the last time i had like i don't remember what it was but it had green chilies in it it was so good so i'm just thrilled to be going back there. It's going to be at 10 a.m. A.m. my friend Jennifer's bringing her baby and I can snuggle him. Okay, and then haircut. I had to move my haircut for brunch because brunch is important. Okay, and then the, nothing else. I've got like YouTube stuff. I'm working on a bunch of videos trying to kind of get a little bit ahead. But for now, I just, I don't have much going on. Okay, this is when we go back to school. So I do want to mark that. Just throw in a label here. And let's use, I know I've got some little teacher ones here. I'm really, really enjoying my break. I wish it was just like one more week, but I will take my two weeks that I got. Okay, back to school. And then I've just got like videos and stuff scheduled and like lots of that kind of thing. But other than that, um, I've got my payday in and then I've got my YouTube payday in. 
And then the 24th, I've got a, oh, actually the 20th is a day off. So I do want to mark that with a little script sticker from Virgo on paper. We have not always gotten off for Martin Luther King Day, but I'm glad that the last couple of years that we have. I'm just going to put that right there. Okay. And then on the 24th, I have a little event to go to called the Big Cheese. It's a macaroni and cheese competition. And I'm really excited to go because some of my students are competing in the competition. And last year they won out of all of the high school teams, which there were like four high school teams along with a bunch of restaurants. And they got fourth place overall, like even up against the restaurants. So I didn't get to go last year. I don't even remember why, but I'm excited to go this year because it's going to be just kind of fun. At least I'm hoping to go. Right now, I don't have anything that day, so I am planning to go. I don't think I have any cheese stickers, but I'm just going to look and see. I think I have a Happy Planner sticker that's like cheese, but it's kind of large if I remember correctly. I could use like one of those little chef ones. Yeah. I don't see anything in here that would work. So let me look and see just how big that is. I don't see down there. Oh, there it is. Okay, here's my Happy Planner food book. So I know there's some cheese in here. Let's see if we can find it. Last year, I think there mac and cheese uh, our schools oh yes okay so that's not too big we can work with that i think i'm gonna use this one it's a little block um last year their recipe included um green chilies i think and oh, i can't even remember but it was it was good i got to have some of it okay that will work so this is the big cheese. It's six to eight, but I'll write that like on the actual day. And then this is my friend Seth's birthday. So I want to mark that. He's one of my favorite people at school. He's also an author and his work is just phenomenal. Um, he also makes me laugh a lot. He's hysterical. Okay, I think I want to go with maybe a little Coffee Monsters Co. Um, one of these. Put that right there. And then mark sets. Oh god, that's going to bug me. Okay, we're going to fix it. But his wife is actually the one who sold me my house. She's a realtor in town. A really good realtor, by the way. Um, she built her company like from the ground up by herself. And now she has like 50 employees. Their company sells in Austin, in New Mexico, and Texas, in Amarillo, like everywhere. She's just amazing. There we go. All right. And the rest of the month, I have nothing. So I always say this every single time, but I promise you it will fill up. It will definitely, definitely fill up. I mean, let's look at December real quick. So here is December. And today is, like I said, the 29th. So I just have a few more days to fill in. And this is just like overload. I know this is like too much for some people, but I love the full look. I just love it. So here is the spread. It's going to look so pretty. I'm just really excited to see how this turns out. And then I've got my tending list here and my prayer list. I will have, by the time this video goes up, I will have my goal video up and you'll be able to see like my whole like process and everything. But um, I will be using this tending list to kind of check in with my goals every month, see what I need to do, like the big tasks 
And then I can refer to this when I'm building my weekly spreads. So here's the first week. I haven't even planned this out yet, but I will in just a minute. But yeah, I'm just really excited. I feel like I'm in like a groove with my monthly and my, um, like my tending list and all of that stuff. It feels really good. So I'm just excited to see what 2020 brings and in my life and my planner, everything. So I hope that you enjoyed this spread. If you did, give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you're not already subscribed to my channel. And I'll see you next time. Bye.